Hello and welcome to the Tivoli Monitoring Academy. My name is Saurabh Nachne and I am a software engineer at IBM. In this video, you will learn how to import the OS agent reports version 6.3 fix pack 2 in TCR 3.1 on a Red Hat Linux machine. You will also see how to access the predefined reports once the installation is completed. The procedure is similar on Windows as well, so please refer to the summary slides for more details. Before you begin, please make sure that TCR 3.1 is installed in your environment. TCR 3.1 is available in the JazzSM service management package. You only need the reporting services. If you need a separate graphical user interface, you can also install the Dash services or the visualization services. Also make sure that the OS agent reports bundle is downloaded. Version 6.3. You can see the agent reports package is available on this server. To initiate the import, you need to copy the appropriate files to the deployment folder in the Cognos directory. So let's proceed uh, further. So you need to go under the reports directory. From here, go under the Cognos reports directory and then under the OS agent reports directory. If you see the IBM Tivoli monitoring OS agent reports dot zip file, this is the file we need to copy to the deployment folder in Cognos in order to begin the import. I've executed the copy command to copy the agent reports dot zip file to the Cognos deployment directory. Once this is completed, if you if you navigate to the opt IBM JazzSM reporting Cognos deployment directory, you will see the OS agent reports dot zip file listed under there. Now the default path on your machine uh, for the JazzSM install can be in a separate directory. So copy it to the appropriate location and then you're ready to begin your import. I have the dash or the visualization service and the reporting services from the JazzSM bundle installed on this server. So I'm going to log in through this portal and then access the Tivoli Common Reporting Portfolio through here. If you don't have the Dash installed on your server, please refer to the summary slide for the URL you need to use in order to access Common Reporting. Once you are under Common Reporting, go under the Launch dropdown and hit the IBM Cognos administration option. Once you're in this option, go to the configuration panel and in the left hand side pane, select content administration. Here you will get an option to import on the options provided on the right hand side top corner. Select new import and you will see the IBM Tivoli monitoring OS agent reports file here. So select next. On the next screen, you can uh, enter a name which suits uh, your uh, description. Uh, this is just the name which it will store in the deployment specifications. So I'm going to say IBM monitoring OS agent reports and this is 6.3 fix pack 2 so I'm going to record the appropriate version here and then say next on the next screen 
all the options can be kept as default and you have to select the report that you need to import. If you want to change the name of your reports, you can do so by selecting the option that I chose. I'm going to highlight that one more time. This is the option over here. This can be used if you have two separate versions of the reports in your environment. I'm going to leave it as it is and say next. After I do this, I'm going to select all the default options and say next on this screen as well. I'm going to hit next again. And once I am at the last screen, uh, it gives you an option to save and run once, which is the default. I'm going to select that and then hit finish. Once this is done, you can select the run option and that will complete the process. Now under the content administration option, you will see the IBM Tivoli monitoring OS agent reports. To access these reports, go back to Cognos connections. This will return you back to the home screen. Over here, a new selection will be available and all the reports under, under the OS agent reports bundle will be available here. As you can see, you have four different OS agent report categories, the availability, common shared libraries, prerequisite validation and utilization. The availability and utilization reports are the widely used one. The prerequisite validation report will let you know if you have all the available prerequisites in place in order to run the rest of the reports. So this concludes the import of the OS agent reports in TCR. This will help you generate the operating system reports or the OS agent reports for your infrastructure. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video at the CNSI Monitoring Academy. We'd definitely appreciate your feedback, so please feel free to use the comments box below. We'd also love you to click the thumbs up if you appreciated the video. We have added several helpful links to all our content. I would definitely recommend you check out the blogs on DevWorks. Take care.